Hey guys, Chita Fahedung here to talk about my upcoming short, White Noise. As the video from last weekend explains, White Noise is an adaptation of a short story by Joff Gander, and it's the first script that I've written in five years. It's also my return to directing a short film since Up and Away last year. The Indiegogo campaign is still going to run for a little while, so go check that out and make a pledge. Uh, help me make this film. Actually, the reason I'm making this video is because there are two reward tiers that I think you would be interested in. In those reward tiers, you can book one-on-one -on -one time with me and I can help you with questions or issues or ideas regarding anamorphic shooting. For example, putting together your first setup or finding a scope that fits your already existing shooting style and how to do that under your limited budget, whatever that budget is. I've been doing this type of consulting for a little while and so far I only have positive feedback. So go check those rewards and let's get your questions all sorted out. Of course, the examples I mentioned are more towards beginners, but if you're an advanced shooter and you got more specific questions, I'd be happy to help you as well. A little more about the technical aspects of white noise. Besides writing and co-directing, I'm also responsible for the cinematography. I've been putting the GH5 through its paces and it's going to be our camera, but I haven't made up my mind yet if I'm shooting with the Maxiscope, which is the pseudo rehousing for the Iskorama by Max Prodenuk, or if I'm using a Frankenrig with a Coa B&H and a single focus solution. What do you think? What's your input? What do you think would fit best a narrative short? Let me know in the comments. Uh, for taking lenses, we're 90% set on the contact size set, but we might swing for like our R's last minute. We'll see how that goes. And I'm doing a minimalistic lighting style, which does not mean low light. Let's keep that in mind. Uh, <laughs> and I'm working on shooting more behind the scenes and writing down all of my findings so I can share them here with you. It's been really tough. So. On the note of sharing, the other short I directed, Up and Away, is becoming public later today at 10 a.m. Pacific time, not even two hours from now. So stay tuned and subscribe to the channel so you're notified when it comes online. I would love to hear what you think of it and if you have any questions about the shooting process. That's it for this week. Stay here for Up and Away in a little bit. Make a pledge at the Indiegogo campaign and subscribe to the channel for more information. I'm Chut Fedungs and I'll see you soon. Thanks.